you're here for the world premiere of The Cake Maker. What was the original spark of the idea for the story? Um, it started actually with a real story of someone that I, I knew. I knew a man who uh, had a double life. He had a wife and he had three children. And uh, parallel to this wonderful family life, he would meet uh, all kind of men and have all kind of affairs. And um, this is a story I know in many. I mean, it's quite a common thing that people that have this double life uh, or, their, or hide their different uh, aspects of their identity, hide them from the ones closer to them. And this uh, person that I knew personally, I knew him, uh, I found out that he died. Uh, his uh, wife sent an email to me telling him that he died and from a disease. I think it was cancer, but I'm not, I'm not even sure. And uh, this was the beginning of the idea to create a story which deals with uh, that point where the, 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 this death, how it affects two people, the wife from one hand, and the, let's say, the lover, the, the secret part of the life. What is the ultimate message of the cake maker, if there is an ultimate message? I think that uh, the film tries to, in, in the end, tell people who don't want to be defined in a certain way, sexually or nationally or uh, religiously. It's, all of these things are not important. And uh, the for me, the film in the end tells about people who want to step out of these definitions and redefine themselves by a, a just simple intimate connection. What is your own connection to baking? I love baking. <laughs> I love, love food, I love baking, I love eating. It has uh, so many meanings to me. Um, food, and especially baking, is uh, a whole cultural system full with so many meanings and so many symbolic meanings and so many uh, traditions and so many uh, practical aspects of a day of life of uh, what time are you do you wake up to knead the dough how much time does the dough have to stand well, how many amounts of, of, of sugar what kind of color it has all of these things are so full of passion and so full of uh, um, it's like it's, it's it's like flesh it's like uh, uh, like body it's uh, it's so dynamic and it's so uh, powerful and it's also on the other hand so basic and so simple i mean bread and and, and rolls it's simple things that we consume sometimes as the very last thing you know it's the very basic thing and a, uh, you know a piece of bread with a bit of olive oil that's all you need you know so it's um i think it's a very strong uh, wonderful element, this food, and uh, I just love it very much.